Under the light motif, Kalpir for Change transforms young people to global citizens. Our project brings together people from the global south with young people in Europe. As part of cultural exchange, internationally recognized artists design workshops and performances that contain political messages. Students communicate global perspectives and visions to students through their stories and creativity. The three main goals, which are all part of the Sustainable Development Goals initiated by the United Nations in 2015, are combating climate change, protecting children's rights and managing migration. Within the implementation of peer learning, they are essential to the partner organizations Kinderkulturkarawane, municipalities and NGOs in Bulgaria, Denmark, Germany, Italy, Austria, Poland and Slovenia, as well as projects in Tanzania and Bolivia to build an inclusive, sustainable and resilient future for our planet and its people. Hab Tamnesh is a circus artist from Debare Berhan with a journey full of adventures ahead. In her brilliant contortion act, she bends her body like a snake. The candles on top of her toes convey a romantic feeling. Habtamnesh, a beautiful, intelligent young woman who fights for her rights by doing what she loves. Kalpia for Change introduces a new learning concept for young people inside and outside of schools. Peer-to-peer -peer learning implicates that students work together and develop collaborative skills. We, the Circus Debere Berhan, start our Europe tour in Germany. While outside the autumn weather paints tree leaves orange, red and purple, our acrobats train with artists from a youth circus in Radebeul. Together with them, we build human pyramids, play juggling balls and run stilts. Dedication and creativity from two continents meet inside a little hall in the middle of nowhere. After a fruitful jam session with Fanuel, Lul and Jesak, the clash of cultures continues. Following an invitation to the nearby observatory, we listen to universe experts together with our new friends. It comes from space? Yeah. This one? Yeah. And a meteorite. It's kind of iron. Yeah, this is mostly, it's 90, 92-93% iron. What begins with the discovery of a meteorite ends with a starlit sky flying above us. Millions of little light dots, planets and the moon. Starting in Europe, we first pass the Mediterranean Sea and after a short glimpse to North Africa, the planetarium arrives in Ethiopia. We wonder, where is the Milky Street? The sounds of a mesmerizing female voice accompany Habtamnesh as she introduces the show. Again, her gracious movements enchant everyone in the audience. Distinguished elegance. Noticeably captivated by the variety of performances, the spectators move outdoors, where Lul is already awaiting them for the grand finale. In his breathtaking slack wire act, he crosses a thin steel rope with a bicycle rim a speciality only he can do. Peaceful silence lies in the Otto Hahn School in Hamburg, a picturesque building from the 70s, the decade of hippies and rock and roll.
Today our musician Fanuel is sharing his drumming skills with great young talents. The drummers balance the combined use of snare drum, hi-hat and tom. An afternoon peppered with rhythms and fun ends too quickly, but leaves a mark with the hopeful knowledge of reunion in the future. The canteen's wall is decorated with various flags. We do a quiz about who knows the matching countries. Like fish in the aquarium, we dream of a world without borders, where each person is respected for their uniqueness. Embodying this vision, Beza, the hula hoop artist and clown, prepares the evening performance. Drummer Fanuel is a trusted friend who works hard to guarantee perfect sound and lightning. In his break, he shows us a folk dance which increases everyone's curiosity. We fight for survival. You know the Bombardier music? Buffalo soldier. As a consequence to the words of the artistic director Teklo, the circus goes on an expedition. At the same moment when Solomon learns how to fasten his rope, Habtamnesh is already advancing to the first obstacle. Don't worry about a thing, because every little thing is gonna be all right, is another line of Marley's song lyrics that immediately comes to our minds when we think of reggae and the unifying power of music. Personifying these conscious words, we fly to our next destination, Wrocław. In the park near the Brave Kids compound, the trees still blossom in a rich green. Car engine sounds mingle with the chatter of a youth that hasn't stopped believing in the strength of togetherness. The more people engage in a trick, the more exciting it can become. Small mistakes only help to stand up again, find new ideas and create something special in the unknown. Circus Debre Berhan is a circus for all. Nothing is impossible and no one is discriminated against. Now we learn names in sign language with Habtamnesh, who is deaf herself. I love Exploring the question of how to communicate in Polish and Ethiopian sign language, small groups elaborate basic phrases. In a film, the learning progress is captured. What a beautiful way to study peer to peer. Our first visit to Poland is almost over. We feel nostalgic, but remain curious about what will happen in the coming weeks. Lul is unstoppable. He works on perfecting his act. Adrenaline runs through his veins while the air is filled with a tangible awareness of danger. People in Ethiopia use a different calendar. A year has 13 months. 
365 days of sunshine. Back in our guest house, an important celebration is waiting for us. It is New Year. Time to forget about work, but also time to sing and dance in joy. We leave behind new experiences and enter a post-socialist reality in which we pass on our social activism to a young audience. Human rights, climate justice, gender equality, feminism and anti-racism are the fundamental topics which inspire us to create new pieces. Beza and the jugglers share a room where Japanese kendo masters usually practice their art. Swords hang on the wall. Our strong African circus masters rehearse. Beza stretches and does a split. Knives fly through the air. Only with extreme precision, Solomon, Lul and Yisak manage to catch the props. Haptamnesh wears the giraffe costume. She misses home and takes a break from many weeks of performing. Whereas the spectacle on stage makes hundreds of people freak out, this is a moment of melancholy, a moment of calmness in which sensitivity and tenderness shine through. Outside it is showtime, while Haptamnesh's longtime companion Abonish takes a moment for herself too. More than 20 years ago, she came to the circus as an orphan. Nowadays, she is one of the leading trainers. It is thanks to her and her friends that Ethiopia is full of talented and highly skilled artists. Lul's workday is over, but the show in the schoolyard must go on. The Bulgarian city of Plovdiv is characterized by Roman architecture, prehistoric traces and newly restored buildings. We live in the old town, next to a music school, churches, art stores and protected sites. Sometimes we hear violin playing, chirping birds or the charming voice of a storyteller with lovely puppets. Mm. Women's rights were the main inspiration for our physical theatre play I Have a Dream. Those who belong to Circus Debere Perhan feel a strong loyalty towards the group and the art of circus. It feels like more than being a family. Despite a different rhythm and contrasting footsteps, The roots of folk dance in Ethiopia and Bulgaria have many similarities. In both countries, dance serves as a bridge between people to open up and enjoy conviviality. The widely spread belief in the Orthodox Church and St. Mary is another commonality. Mm -hmm. 
not far from Plovdiv, placed in a mountainous area, the circus troupe finds the wonder-working icon of the Virgin Mary Eloisa. The mystic ambience, colorful paintings and the distinct presence of spirituality make this excursion unforgettable. Two days are left for the big show in the ancient stadium. This is a rare opportunity and the acts need to be adjusted to the unfamiliar setting. Lul and Teglu select tracks from the music archive. They won't get tired of listening to music to find a song that will animate the crowd to dance. At night, the ancient Roman theatre lies untouched. Only a few hours later, the artists arrive. They do some contortion and soak up the aura of this magical place. Where once competitions in front of majesties were held, our circus finally becomes part of this history. The two soulmates, Beza and Habtamnesh, stand on a railing during beautiful sunset light. Their memories are fresh. Many encounters and explorations captured with photographs will stay with them for many years. The tour strengthened the bond between the artists even more. Due to the knowledge of infinite companionship and a new network of supporters, their living dream gains exciting chapters. A circus dance of life that continues throughout the darkness of the night. Light shines through the treetops in the garden of our home. Przemysl is a charming town close to Ukraine. We stay in a monastery, nuns cook for us and the whole town is on its feet to make our stay convenient. The morning sun doesn't enter our workshop destination. Lul plays a song on the piano. His curiosity is never ending. Just like the hunger of the workshop participants, a talented, funny group of youngsters eager to learn. During the warm-up, it soon becomes clear that they want to put on an incredible show for their parents. Solomon immediately finds a partner. Next to Beza's hula hoop group, they develop ideas. Various circus disciplines, from magic to juggling, are performed on mattresses borrowed from the local kindergarten. The weather is foggy, winter is around the corner, but our feelings are far from cold. Teklu is in his element. As always, he directs with all his heart. Whatever happens around him doesn't matter anymore. Physical theater is what he loves. Beza loves being a clown. Every clown needs a red nose and, of course, a great circus to support her. Just be happy, enjoy. Even if you make mistake, 
Don't worry, because we are human, we make mistakes. Come on, 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 come on. Together. Besa smiles. She's dressed in an entirely red clownish pyjama. Kids, parents and grandmas are hypnotized from her performance. Her hoops spin around her hands, neck, hips and knees. Hilarious elegance. Besides learning acrobatic disciplines, the circus loves music. Inside the art school in Dobrova Gornica, Fanuel meets the music teacher. Following a little jam with Lou, he takes part in a class, explains about the tuning styles in Ethiopia. We have four tuning styles. Okay. Um, we call it one, it is the tap. Mm -hmm. We call it two, party, ambassa and anchovie. Oh, it's interesting. We have four. It's like, it's like different. We have to hear the music. It's different. In one week, Circus Debere Berhan will meet three other international groups to perform at the final event of the tour. Before that, we relax in the water park Nemo. In a friendly bowling match, a high number of amazing throws are scored. Swimming is our passion. Here, we try slides for the first time in our lives. We laugh all afternoon, swim to the outside area and find space to improve our skills. Leaving behind positive vibes, we, the queens and kings from Africa, are ready for new adventures. <laughs> the pressure is high. Will the circus Debere Berhan manage to present a great performance on the big stage of Köln? Fanuel notes the songs for the show and Teklu gives his last advice. New ideas are added to the scenery of I Have a Dream. Without hesitation, Solomon and Yisak balance on their ladders. There is no longer any doubt that nothing stands in the way of a successful night. Smoke surrounds Haptamnish's appearance. She is confident and happy about Teklu's inventive soul. In Köln, Teatro Trono from Bolivia, the Dreamcatchers from India and the Kigamboni Community Center from Tanzania create a show together with Circus Debre Berhan, in which they perform scenes from their everyday lives, from the lives of their families, peers and neighborhoods, with theater, dance, circus, acrobatics and music. Through this project, young Europeans gain instant access to cultures from around the world. This is what inspires all of us to reflect on our responsibilities and replace injustice with equality. We preserve our individuality and stand united 
as global citizens. Backstage nervousness disappears, transforms into excitement. Everything works perfectly. Through his speech and songs, our patron Ron Williams helps to reach our dream of global justice and equality. Culpier for Change provides new innovative examples of learning methods. This has incredible impact on young people who start to influence policy, which is what is needed. For us, it is time to say goodbye. Solomon and the others draw positive memories of our days in Europe. At the North Sea, the locals treat us like guests for the last time, but we know this is the beginning of our lifelong circus show for peace. Oh